Welcome back to another video. Today, I will be explaining to you guys the differences between goalie gloves. So, single T versus double T, one piece cuff versus two piece cuff, the different catching angles, and finally the fit. And at the end of this video, I'll put a picture of all the key points for anyone who wants to take a picture or just look over it. The reason you'll get a single T goalie glove is because you'll really get to feel the puck enter your glove, enter the pocket of your glove. You'll really get to feel that. It's gonna feel like a snap and it's gonna really feel nice. Some people say the puck might pop out of a single T glove, but I don't agree with that because whatever goes into the pocket is most probably not gonna come out. Personally, I have never had any issues with that and I have a single T goalie glove. One reason you'll get a double T goalie glove is because the pocket's wider. Some people say the pocket is deeper, which it's not, it's not true. The pocket is wider, it's not deeper though. You are also more likely to be able to see the puck through the pocket of your glove since in double T goalie gloves, it's wider. In between the double T's, there's gonna be a window. So you might be able to see through that a little more. Now, one piece versus two piece glove. A two piece cuff gives more flexibility in the wrist. And that helps when you're trying to do things like stick handle or shoot the puck. The one piece cuff is more rigid. I like to use this comparison. I compare the one piece cuff to the pads that are more rigid and, and uh, stiff. And I like to compare the two piece cuff to pads that have the knee rolls and are softer and are more flexible and easier to bend. Next, we're gonna talk about 90 and 60 degree breaks. Now the 90 degree break is as if you're making a thumbs up sign with your hand. You bring your fingers towards your palm and your thumb is pretty much up. Now for the 60 degree break, it's more like you're bringing your fingers towards your thumb. When looking at the fit of your glove, there shouldn't be more half an inch between the tip of your fingers and the tip of the glove. To test if your glove fits properly, open up your glove and just check, I, <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. So I hope this helped you guys. And if you guys enjoyed the video and you found this helpful, please leave a like and subscribe. It helps me out a lot. Thanks for watching.